my previous video, I have shown you the NARS lipstick, the mini lipstick. Now I just thought of doing a swatch and then trying it on as well. Let us try first the inappropriate red. So that's how it looks like. It doesn't look very red actually. Let's try it on our lips. It's very red on the phone on the video, but it's not really very red. Now when we put this on our lips, depends on the pigmentation of your lips. So I have quite a light pigmentation on my lips and I actually like red lipstick or dark colored lipstick, so I don't mind this one. We will see if it would just transfer quickly onto our cotton pad. It did, but as you could see, there's still some left. So we probably need like a lipstick remover for this one. Let's move on to the rose cliff. There. And when you swatch it, it's very nude. Look at that. Let's try and put it on our lips if it's. It just looks like your lips is just pigmented. Something. Actually, the inappropriate red is a matte finish. The rose cliff is satin finish. After I'll do the swatch, I will show you some clips when I was using the one of the colors, and then you can check if how long it lasted on for me. So we have here the Lovin' Lips. It's obviously, you've seen that I've used it quite a lot now this is a matte finish as well so let's swatch this one so that's around like three four strokes let's put it on our lips and see now this is a matte finish as well but it doesn't feels like it's dry it's it doesn't have a drying effect on your lips Let's try and I actually like this color than the other ones, but let's try the other ones first. Let's try and remove it with a cotton pad. There's still a little bit left. Then the last one is the Jolie something, which is I really can't pronounce. This is a matte finish too. So it's kind of like a maroon thing, maroon color. Let's try it on. I actually like these colors. I like these two. The Jolie something and this one as well. So my top color is that. This, the Lovin' Lips. And then the inappropriate red and then the last one is the nude i'm not really a fan of nude colors as i have mentioned we'll try and remove it first so that i could show it to you just a plain cotton pad and as i have mentioned it seems like you you put some lip tint on on your lips so we will remove it completely yeah so it's all off now so please continue watching this video because i'm going to insert some clips on the day that i was using it and see how it went let me know also what your thoughts are regarding this lipstick and just keep on watching so guys time check it's 10 57 in the morning and i am wearing the Levin lips nars mini lipstick it's a matte finish and I will update you later and look at my 
driver seat lever. Time check is 12 noon and our lipstick is still on and look at the marks from the surgical mask. We're now leaving Bunnings guys. Time check it's 1 o'clock in the afternoon. Our lipstick is still on. It smudged a little bit on the surgical mask but it's still pretty much all good on the lips. Let us go and get some lunch and then we will find out what this will look like later. I am back. I had lunch. I had fried rice for lunch and spicy chicken and now I'm having matcha latte. And so far, lip is still on. 3.23 in the afternoon and so far so good still. It's 7.30 in the evening. We had dinner and look at our lipstick. There's still some left here. Let's take our lipstick now. So let's remove it now. I'm using this to remove my lipstick. You can also use this for your face to remove makeup. But since I don't use anything or any foundation or something, I just use this for my lipstick. And it's you. It is suitable for face, eyes, and lips. So it has come off now and... Fairness for this lipstick, it has last long. For as I have said, since 9 o'clock in the morning until 7.30 in the evening, even without retouching or doing anything, I had coffee, I had lunch, and then I had milk tea, I had dinner, had some water, and then I had another coffee, so and it was still on. So if ever you have to buy it, the, the mini ones, it's it's a good buy for those little ones. And the lipstick itself, even though it's a matte finish, it's not drying and you know, some matte lipsticks are very drying and then your lips would crack afterwards. But the, that one so far, it feels like it feels like it's not a matte finish. However, when you like wipe some cotton pad on it, some of it comes off, but still remains. Some of it still remains on your lips. So it would still do if you wanna retouch or anything like that however as i have said i haven't retouched for the whole day and it's still there even at the now so it's a plus for me that's all for this vlog and i'll see you on my next videos keep safe everyone bye